Hello, good afternoon, welcome to day 95 of the guitar accompanying sessions that could go horribly wrong. I just say a massive thank you to Mr David Ledson yesterday for the brilliant piece on Lee Constantino. Now, I can't stress enough how more raucous and vibrant we're going to go from that beautiful waltz that you did yesterday. We're going to go Greek on you today, that's right, yeah, it's the Greeks. Um, <laughs> this is the lovely, amazing Miss Sarah Horn on the fiddle today. Now, I first saw Sarah um, very, very when she was very young uh, as a part of the duo with uh, James Cudsworth. And then I heard her later with her big band called Aphorin, who were absolutely brilliant. And I did notice that uh, Sarah was that fast playing the fiddle. You can sometimes see smoke coming off her fingers. It was absolutely brilliant. Always nice to catch up with Sarah in the beer tent. Normally hang around with uh, bandmates, boyfriend and mum. You name it, excellent. And uh, I think the last time I saw her, I was I had quite a few beers. And she actually dragged me up to uh, dance her at the Cayley. And I completely got lost what, with what I was doing. So apologies for that, Sarah. Um, <coughs> Sarah's going to do um, a few Greek tunes now for you. So... If you've got any plates that you don't want, feel free to have a dance and smash them on the floor. Um, I absolutely love going on holiday to Greece. I've done a few of these um, flotilla holidays um, on the yachts where you kind of um, go from island, island hopping basically and you're staying on board a boat. And of course this sort of music was played um, quite frequently so it's real nostalgic to hear this. And I remember one time when there was a big storm that uh, happened on the island of Lacca. If everyone knows Greece very well. And um, I remember waking up the next morning and finding out that our boat had actually gone into the middle of the, um, into the harbour because uh, we were told to motor it out and uh, drop the anchor. And I had no idea whatsoever where we'd gone. I felt the next morning feeling incredibly sick. I just thought it was down to the storm, but it was actually the copious amounts of Metaxa I was drinking, which I was told about later on that day. So, of course, every time I see Mr John McIntosh, or aka Tool, uh, the bass player from Peeping Tom, he does his lockdown lighter picture where he shows a picture of a spirit or a whiskey or a brandy that he's drinking. Every time I see that, it makes me think of that fateful morning. And of course, hearing this music does too as well, but all for good, all for good cause. So I'm going to do my best to try and keep up with this. It's got a real good beat to it. So um, have you got any feta cheese or anything like that? Or, um, any ouzo? Um, any uh, masaka, kleftika, sakanaki, anything? Get it out, eat it, dance, smash your plates, enjoy this. So, see you tomorrow for day 96. Go on, Sarah.
Wow, that was amazing. I don't think I've ever played anything like that at all. Seriously. I think even at Greece I wasn't able to hold a guitar for the amount of ooze and stuff that I've been having. But no, that was absolutely phenomenal. And I must admit, I'm glad I'm not a drummer because I think I would have struggled to play along with that big time. But thank you so much, Sarah. Look forward to seeing you again all being well in 2021 at the festivals. Keep up the good Greek work and much, much more. So, thanks so much, guys. Enjoy your Tuesday. And I'll see you tomorrow for... Um, a Bellahead and a Faustus member. Cheers, bye.